So, uh, yeah, New York finally legalized Bud, bro. Yeah. So, hold on, let me gotta clap it up for that one. Right. New York finally fucking legalized. Yo, it took way too long, bro. I thought by the time um, at least California legalized that we were going to have it because, exactly. like, bro, I was like, yo, we live on the East Coast. We're a blue state. Like, we're liberal. Mm -hmm. uh, everybody smoked anyway. Exactly. Like, you know what I'm saying? It? No, Nobody got in trouble for, like, yo, I'm telling you, you could smoke blunts and shit right in front of the police and, and the NYPD, Suffolk County, Nassau. They did not give a fuck. Unless you was like really wailing or some shit like that, like yeah. you know what I'm saying, like, um, but this is the stuff that came along with the new law that was passed. Um, the police can't search your car no more if it smells like bud. Um, you can't carry more than three ounces. Uh, you or you can't purchase more than three ounces. You can't have more than three plants per individual. Mm. So like. Yeah, like, growing it. Alright, so yeah, that, that's pretty much... That's pretty much that. But, uh... I'm embarrassed right now, and I'm gonna tell you why. Long Island, for whatever reason, decided that they wanted to ban retail. I don't know if they're gonna go all the way through with that decision, because there's only one representative on Long Island that wants to ban retail. So, um... Let's see how that goes, but um, the, the way it's looking right now is they want to ban retail on Long Island altogether. We're going to have to go to the city or whatever to buy weed, which is whack as fuck. And they're saying, oh, it's because they want to upkeep the, the quality of life. How is that? Yo. Exactly. I like get that, bro. That don't even make sense because if they want us to up, upkeep the quality of life, that's every reason why they should have a dispensary exactly. on Long Island. You want niggas to be trapping still? That's really? kind of how it sounds. It kind of sounds like they just want niggas to keep trapping. They want um, they want people to keep going to jail for selling drugs on the street. Like mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying. Like that. That's kind of fucked up. You know. You know what I'm saying. And also, it's gonna make the quality of life better because, first of all, all the taxes that are gonna come from selling butt is gonna go right back into yep. the community. And first of all, just because weed is legal now, that's not going to make people just start smoking weed. Like, that don't even make sense. They legalized gay marriage. I ain't become gay. I didn't choose to be gay. I know that's a little different, but like, uh, they legalized, uh, let me think, what else did they legalize? Um... <sighs> well, during Prohibition... Well, prohibition. Think about prohibition. They, well, come to find out, prohibition is when they uh, made uh, drinking illegal. Mm -hmm. But come to find out, that's when they made weed illegal too. Yeah. I didn't know that. I did my research. They made weed illegal too around this time. But when prohibition was over after the Americans fought, alcohol became legal and weed stayed illegal for whatever fucking reason. So that means our country knew what we did before. What the fuck? Like, yo, why was we sleeping on weed for all this time? Bro, at least we live in a, li we live in a lifetime where when we were younger, we weren't even thinking about smoking weed like that. Mm -hmm. But it was illegal when we started smoking weed. Like, I started smoking weed when I was, what, like, like 16? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so I started smoking then, and it was illegal. But I'm not even 21 yet. And now it's legal? Like, yeah, it's lit. Yeah, like, you know what I'm saying? Lit, that's lit. You know how many niggas went to jail over this shit? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that's another thing that's going with the uh, the legalization. They're going to start releasing people for... Uh, that's good. Yeah. Yeah, so that's real good. Uh, real good. But um, I don't know how they're going to treat people for selling uh, butt on the street. I don't know if they're going to get fined or what. Mm. It, it probably just depends how much you yeah. get caught selling. Like, if you get caught with a dime on you, you'll probably, like, you'll probably be good. But if you get caught with, like, like a, like, like a, two pounds in your car or mm -hmm. some shit, they're going to be like, all right, now, like, what are you doing with all this shit? Yeah. Especially considering you can't buy more than three ounces from the dispensary at a time. Mm -hmm. So you can smoke anywhere you want to. Um... 
pretty much anywhere you can smoke a cigarette, you can smoke, bud, which is good. I thought That's they were good. gonna be. Discriminatory. Yeah. I thought they were gonna be like, "Oh, you can smoke a cigarette here, but you can't smoke weed." Here. I was really gonna be like, first of all, Wait, cigarettes is the worst." Like, well, that's what I'm saying. I, that's that's another reason I was tight about this shit. I was like, "Why the fuck is weed illegal when cigarettes is legal?" I was like, if "For all that, you should make all this shit illegal. If you want, <laughs> if you want to do it, if you want to do it, make all this shit illegal." But um, I, I'm happy that it's legal now. But uh, what what are you excited about? Like the legalization, you like you. Hell yeah! Things you want to try, anything like that? Uh, to be honest, like I'm just excited to like not have that fear of like weed, like having weed, smoking weed, mm -hmm. having the cops pull you over, like could finally just be like chilling, be high and shit. Facts, yo. Like, and another thing, like it's also gonna destigmatize like quote unquote potheads yeah. now. Like, I smoke bud like every day, like, but. I get my work done. Like I, I have a job. Yeah. I trade in the stock market. I have my podcast. Exactly. Like I, I'm doing the thing. Like you know what I'm saying. Like so. Now it's not gonna look like oh everybody that smokes weed is lazy and da da da. I mean some people are still gonna think that, but it is what it is. I I don't care what you think. You know. Um. So the shit I want. You know it's funny. I put the same thing. Like I'm, I'm just gonna be less paranoid. Like yeah. like I remember, like I would be. Like, me and my girl, we would want to go to, uh, like, the movies or some shit to, like, mm -hmm. like, but we like to smoke before we watch movies or if, if we go to a, a, a beautiful park or some shit, we want to be able to smoke, yeah, but, thanks. like, bro, we were like, yo, can we smoke butt here? Like, well, like, if we went to, like, any, like, if we went to black neighborhoods, we were like, man, we gonna smoke where the yeah. fuck we want to, <laughs> like, like, cause, like, niggas don't care, like, we never cared about shit like that, but. If we went to like a white neighborhood, like like on the North Shore, like like Brookhaven and shit like that, mm -hmm. or Brookville, or, like or Smithtown, like yep. I was like, bro, like I don't know if I should smoke out here because I don't want to hear nobody coming out like I'm calling the police. Like yeah. I'm about to be like, by the time the police get here, I'm about to be done with this <laughs> shit. Like you look dumb, my nigga. Like, uh, but I, I'm ready to cook with weed. I want to try cooking with weed, bro. Yep. I want to make edibles. I want to make edibles. I want to make like. Real dishes with bud, like lasagna. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I don't want to try real. Like you ever watch that show, Cooking on High? Cooking on High? Yeah. Like I want to try stuff like that. Um, for those of you that know that, for those of you that don't know what Cooking on High is, it's a show where um they just cook shit with bud. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's dope as fuck. Y'all should check it out. I can't watch shit like that though all the time because I I be getting fucking hungry. So if I watch that <laughs> shit, I'd be like, yo. And I don't be knowing how to cook those kinds of shit. Yeah. And I don't even have the budget and the money to be cooking yeah, all that so kind hard. of shit. So, uh, next best, the next best thing is to just buy some food, which costs mad money. And if I don't feel like going out, I get that shit on Uber Eats. So, even if you just got a 10-piece McNugget, that <laughs> like shit might be $40, this. nigga. Like, yeah. <laughs> Yo, yo, I fucking hate Uber Eats, nigga. Where yo, I just want to get, what, two... If I go to Wendy's and I, and I get, what, uh, uh, what, a chicken sandwich and some fries mm -hmm. and, a, and a drink for me and my girl, like, and I go in person, how much would that be? What, like, that shit might be mad cheap. That shit might be, like, no more than 15 bucks. That might be way too much. It might be, yeah, like, four for fours, like, or, yo, 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 my nigga, if I get two four for fours, <laughs> that shit, yo, that shit should be $8 in person, right? Or it's, a, it's some change because of tax, right? <laughs> So let's say somebody delivers the shit. If I get two four for fours, <laughs> that shit should be like, I'll say like 15. 15 plus the tip, you know. Yo, $20. Yeah. Damn, I just paid $20 for a four for four. <laughs> Never mind. You see what I'm saying? You see what uh, I'm saying? Yeah. Like, that shit's crazy. <laughs> Yo, oh, no, bro. Yo, Yo I don't know. Crazy. That shit's crazy. crazy. But sometimes, I don't know. I feel like. <laughs> Actually, let, let me be realistic with them. $20 for a 444, that's realistic. I'll give them that. But I feel like, say I get Dairy Queen or some shit, and I get two blizzards <laughs> for me and my girl, you know. I get, I don't know, fries and a burger for me and my girl. Mm -hmm. Shit come there, and it's like $35. I'm like, my nigga, that's like crazy. $35. Yeah, what, I'm like, what the fuck? Damn. Like, and think about all those kids that be trying to get Uber Eats and shit. Like, and they should be saving up for college. Or mm -hmm. say they are in college, but they don't drive. 
Yo, exactly. This shit got a discount or something. You know what I'm saying? Free delivery. I don't know. I know it's free delivery for like during certain hours and shit like that, yeah. but even still, I feel like they be hoeing niggas. I feel like every time I open the app, it's like, if you order in the next 30 seconds, I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, nah, nigga. Y'all nigga, y'all do this shit every time I open the app, talking about the next 30 seconds. Y'all niggas gonna still go, <laughs> y'all niggas still gonna make me pay fucking $45 for a medium fry, nigga. Man. Fuck out of here. I, I, I forgot what the fuck. Yo, matter of fact, I'm gonna stay on this topic. I'm gonna tell you why I'm on this topic's ass. Say you, say you smoke, bud, right? Mm. Now you got the munchies. Wait, you don't feel like going God, back God, out. Man, yo, yo, my that nigga. Is. Yo, that shit be dumb ass annoying, bro. Yo. I I'm done with that. Anyway. Yeah, we're going to have better access to edibles. That's what I want to try. That's like, true. I want to try all the different kinds of edibles and shit like that. Because, like, I like edible highs. Like, they're different. I don't be tweaking. Like, I don't take too much. Like, so... Anyway, I feel like we're gonna, it's going to be, yo, I want to try the dispensary grade, like, for all, for the, because for all intents and purposes, like, when, when you buy a bud in the street, like, you don't, you, I mean, I, I trust my, yeah, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> but like, but like, for the most part, like, everybody don't know what the fuck they're yeah, getting, bro, like, true. so, we're going to get dispensary grade bud, you know. So if it says it's runts, you're getting runts. You know, if it says it's sour, you're getting sour. You know what I'm saying? Uh, learning more about Bud. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I want to grow. I want to grow like plants, grow, my yeah. own plants. Like exactly. I want to try that shit. Um, and you know what else is gonna be the dopest shit? Like the conventions and the events, uh, and the events and shit where you can trade yeah, Bud. Yeah, yeah, where yeah. niggas just be out there like giving out free weed and shit. Mm -hmm. Yo, I want to go to one of them shits, bro. Uh, yeah. So, uh, you, you got any, like, last comments you want to make on this whole thing? Um, just happy, like, it's lit. It's going to be lit from now on. Literally.